Good day students. Welcome to Grade 5 Science. For today's episode, I will be discussing the meaning or definition of motion. It seems that everything is moving from the time we wake up until we go to sleep. All our activities involve movement. We have to move in order to complete our task. Life without motion would surely be dull and boring. Motion will always be a part of our daily lives, for it is motion that makes us fully alive as humans. How can you tell if someone is in motion? Motion may be defined as movement of an object brought about by force. They are tension, friction, electrical force, magnetic force, gravitational force, and normal force. When there is movement, there is motion. There can be no motion without a force or set of forces. Forces, therefore, initiate and influence motion. Motion is relative. Consider the passengers in a moving car. The passengers inside the car do not consider themselves moving because they are just sitting in the car. However, the people standing outside consider them moving because the car is changing its position from one point to another point. By definition, motion is a change in position with respect to a reference point. A reference point is a fixed place or object used to determine the position of an object. If the reference point is the ground, outside the car, the passengers are moving. If the reference point is the floor of the car, the passengers are not moving. Compare the pictures on the left. Did the pencils move? If the reference point is the pile of books, the pencil changed its position. However, if the reference point is the pen holder, the pencils did not change position for they are still inside the pen holder. The examples about the car passengers and the pencils show how relative motion is. It all depends on the reference point. Now you know, motion is a change in position with respect to a reference point. A reference point is important in understanding motion because it serves as a basis for which the movement of an object can be related to. Through a reference point, one can tell whether an object has moved or not. 